Vader Episode 1, Shards of the Past, a Star Wars Theory fan film. So guys, we have a new Star Wars fan film out by Star Wars Theory, and um, I know of him, I, I don't really watch his videos that much, like I've, I ch I checked out his channel once, and I, I actually saw a preview for this fan film, like, months ago. Um... Well, yeah, this this should be interesting. Like, a Vader fan film? Like, I don't even know if I've ever seen a Vader fan film. I might have once, but just not, like, recent. Um, but yeah, without further ado, let us react to episode one of this Vader fan film. Here we go. Star Wars Theory. Long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. Wow, okay. Yep. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Wait a minute. Clone troopers? What? This is like, this is Rogue One, but with clones. Yeah, shot troopers. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> Who the fuck? will answer for your treachery. He did. Oh, they got death machines or whatever they're called. <laughs> oh! Oh, force, force. There is no escape. Oh, nice. Yep. Wait a minute. Suffering for your deceit. Answer for your failure to save her. Palpatine? What the fuck? I destroyed your enemies, forged for you an empire. Yet, like the Jedi, you have left me a mere shadow of what I was promised. You have taken everything. Everything? Foolish boy. You grief for the dead wife of an insolent Jedi. Your precious Padme's fate was your choice. Just as your fate is mine. <laughs> oh, force lightning. Wow. I never thought I would ever see this. Bro, that... This, does, this doesn't even look like a fan film, really. Like, oh my god. Such a pity. How much grander and more powerful you could have still become. If you had had the temerity to embrace the path set before you. Oof. Yeah, Vader's fucked. Oh. 
Ooh. Oh my god. Oh, he killed Palpatine. Um, the thing he gave Padme. I made this for you, so you'll remember me. It will bring you good fortune. It's beautiful, but I don't need this to remember you by. My caring for you will always remain. Oh my god. And that? Is why you'll never defeat me. <laughs> of course, it had to be Palpatine. Shall you remain weaker than I? Always the servant, always the slave, Yang Skywalker! <laughs> He was dreaming about it. Proceed. The Emperor demands your presence at once. Lord Vader? As he wishes. Wow, that actually looks good. Seriously. What is thy bidding, my master? You are distressed, my friend. I am fine, my master. Are you now? Your anger radiates like a whirlwind, yet unfocused. No, not unfocused. Hidden. You are trying to hide your rage from me. Why? Uh, ah, I see. Then what is your hesitation, Lord Vader? Give in to your anger. Strike me down. I have no such wish, Master. He does. Pathetic! A mighty Sith Lord crippled by melancholy and indecision. All due to the attachments of a Jedi. There is no attachment. Anakin Skywalker was weak. I destroyed him. Did you? Yet Skywalker's powers were. Just like what he told Ahsoka and Rebels. No. Rise, Lord Vader. It is the way of the Sith to destroy all who stand in a way to power. To eliminate our rivals, is it not? Who stands in your way, Lord Vida? Who holds you back? Keeps you subjected and decrepit within that armor? Anyone? <laughs> if so, only your hate will eradicate you. Use it. Oh, God. I... Cannot, my master. 
That is why my disappointment with you grows by the second. Embrace the choices that have brought you here. Revel in them, or forever live in the shadow of Anakin Skywalker. Now, I have a task for you, my anger princess. There's a great disturbance in the Force. A powerful Jedi survives in the mid rim he must pay the price for his betrayal. As you wish. He hides on my home planet of Naboo. Hmm. And of course, that of the late Queen Padme Amidala. It's gonna trigger him. It is no coincidence. He draws you there because he knows who you are, Lord Vader. The clones that report he wields an amethyst blade. How is that possible? Power. That's how. And you and I both know this particular Jedi wields a great deal of it. I will finish what we started, Master. Will you? Kind of mirrors Kylo Ren's. I wonder. Quote there. Eliminate this Jedi. Pledge yourself to the dark side fully, Lord Vader. Relish in the gifts it bestows upon you. Only then will you be able to cast off the chains that bind you and achieve a power as never before. Only then will you be able to destroy the rival before you. Then I will not fail, Master. Damn. Oh, he's still using his old Jedi Starfighter? Wow, okay. Shuttle. I seem to be afflicted by a sudden tinge of nostalgia to visit my beloved Naboo. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, he's playing something. Troopers do not concern me, Commander. I want that Jedi. I will use the 501st. As you wish, sir. Mm. The 501st. Is there a Jedi down there? Well, yeah, well, yeah, of course, because he's finding a Jedi there. Wow, that was actually really fucking good. Okay, I gotta say, that was actually really freaking good like um it didn't even really look like a fan film honestly like it, it looked like it could have been an actual movie honestly um but yeah it was awesome i loved how uh how vader like had that vision of him fighting palpatine um and vader is basically hiding his anger away from Palpatine because, you know, if, if Palpatine kind of discovers it, you know, that he wants to overthrow him and kill him because of Padme, uh, Vader's gonna kind of die. Because, you know, I don't... Because Vader can't really overthrow Palpatine by himself. He just can't. Like, 
Palpatine just he has more power in the Force than Vader, and I, I just don't think Vader would be a match for Palpatine. I mean, yes, Kylo did kill Snoke in the Last Jedi, but that was because Snoke didn't expect him to, you know. But with Palpatine, he's kind of expecting Vader to over, to want to overthrow him because I mean that's what the Sith do. And Kylo and Snoke are not Sith; they're just Dark Siders, basically. Um, but anyways, awesome fan film. I'm looking forward to episode two, whenever it comes out. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys later. Bye.